Mr. Stu1210. Uh, this is a brand new feature on my channel and it's called Pick Up and Play. Pretty simple. I pick up a game. Here's the game I picked up. F0 GX for the GameCube. Fantastic game. I've never played it before until today and wow, it has really impressed me. It's made by Sega and apparently they're the only people that could uh, ensure that the GameCube game, or this game, was what sort of in full screen, etc. Whatever, it's good. So yeah, this is the pickup, and this is the game. So I'm about to press start. And we're gonna go for Grand Prix, pressing A. I have a novice. So that was the pickup. This is the play. Um, we're going to go for Wild Goose and this person called Pico. Boom, here we go. Let's go for the standard calls. <clears throat> Let's bring up acceleration like that. Pretty much doesn't matter. I've chose the purple vehicle. Right, so yeah, this game is pretty much, um, well it's F-Zero, but it kind of seems like F-Zero on steroids or super crack or something, it's just so amazing, so here we go. It's very, very sensitive, um, what does help is the L and R buttons, they kind of guide you around corners or guide you into the next sort of strip that you need to be in uh, to boost lots of your energy back like this or even just a corner like you can you know use them like that I'm not very good at this game unfortunately I have to say um, I will be practicing that it is just so immense I mean considering we're you know this will be the third generation away when the PS4 and the Xbox phone whatever it is comes out um, but you know the graphics on this are fantastic and uh, half the such very enjoyable. I would anyone that's thinking of getting this game, don't even think about it, just get it. It is that much fun. But, yeah, it's just a single kind of lacking very badly. Uh, there is a boost button which has not been pressing. Uh, best on straights, uh, you can end up blowing up your machine. But you know you want to charge on these pads, and this level is obviously the basic level, so it's going to be quite nice to you when you first start. Well, I'm in the first position. This hasn't happened before, so uh, well, that's quite good. So I'm happy with that. Will I stay in first? And we'll see. Yay! Finished. Oh, I was first. Brilliant. Seems that practice paid off. Yeah, you first. We'll go to the next stage. Um, yeah, when I was doing some research on this game, um, I found out that you could actually take the memory card from the GameCube and actually stick it into the arcade machine of F-Zero GX. I didn't even know there was an arcade machine of this. Uh, there's nothing like this in sort of South End Essex or anything like that, or Canby. Seafront, it's very poor down there. There's just no actual games anymore apart from absolute pants on, which I can't bother to mention because of that band. But yeah, we'll just quickly give the second level of the furnace. I was buckers. I did get to the third level, and wow, it was tough. So, see if we can get that far. And we'll just uh, pick up the fly. So yeah, back to the, um, whilst I'm playing this, I'm just going uh, to discuss a little bit of the pick up. Got it from some good old CEX, um, it's actually taking a game back at a ball, and it didn't work, and then I was like, oh, checked out the game from section of Zero X, and so I'm having that. And it was eight quid, so very, you know, very good price for this game, in good condition. I had the instructions, which was quite pleased with that, a lot of games in there had the instructions. They don't end up giving to you somehow for whatever reason. But um, yeah, this is uh, fantastic. So, if you 
if you're in America, that's probably going to cost you about fourteen, fifteen dollars, or in um, euros, if you're in Europe, that's probably going to cost you about nine or ten euros, which I think is quite a fair deal, really. Um, although, when you look at the, the price of PS2 games these days, pound, fifty p, three quid, fiver, the games of GameCube are a lot more expensive. So uh, that's that. Anyway, yeah, the play, wow, this game, yeah, it's just out of control. Let's get a boost on the go. Finished. Certainly not first there. 23rd. Bye all. to the next track. I don't see why that person has to sort of scream out there, it's a bit of a weird thing. But, um, I actually really like f -Zero. I had it on the Nintendo SNES, I didn't think of it there. Yeah, I it with Nintendo, and then I had it on Game Boy Advance. And then N64 announcements, so definitely pleased with my pick up. And this level is just frantic. Intense, frantic. Look at this. Whoa! Make sure you're using L and R and stuff. I'm not very good at this time. Hoping to be though in the future. I'll have to have a few red balls and play it too. That might help my uh, reaction time. I am all over the place. Boost on the gun. Get past my rival. Oh, that's not for me. My shield is going down heavily. Getting the, uh, oh, look at that. See, third, you know, even that's in novice, you get to third level and you're not going to get the uh, pit strip, whatever you want to call it. I don't know the official name, but that's what I'm going to call it today, the pit strip on F0. Get a short one uh, so and an extended one. Uh, yeah, I hope everyone uh, is enjoying this new feature. I'm hoping you're doing some more pick up and plays. Uh, that's my new thing. So I'm hoping everyone enjoys this. Uh, if not, you know, just so. That recap, you know. Ha ha ha. You saw my video. Got it. There we go. Full beam. Let's get on straight. Oh my god. Let's beam it around the corner. Boom! Into nine. Oh, wait. Whoa! This game can change not even a second, less than a second. First though, pretty pants. Yeah, whatever. Let's see if we can do the next track. Yep. Yeah. I've never played this track before, so I'll probably die straight away.
D-pad that oh, just likes that. The D-pad can show on here, so that one's pretty cool. Missing all the boosts, and I'm going to blow up any minute if I don't get to a strip pit. I am going to die. I hope not. It's strange. Okay. That is probably a little bit better. My vehicle is not going to die. Oh, okay. Oh, I can boost now. Okay. Will I catch up? Oh, the moment you're there, it's not. There we go. Steaming around the corner. Strip and boost. You can't have to leave it till the final lap in a good position and then just save your boost and then and outrun all the uh, all the leaders. Oh dear. I'll decide to bring me then in the middle of this, so uh, that's pretty really good. retired well that is it people that was the pick up and play um, yeah again hope you've enjoyed it there's going to be some more pick up and plays coming soon your way so uh, stay tuned for that and uh, yeah goodbye all the best to everyone in the world yes